All right, guys, let's do this. It should be fun. My name is Reed Howard. I'm a professional golfer, and uh, thank you guys so much for watching the channel. Uh, we are going to get started with a speed training session. This is going to be a little longer than a normal speed training session that I do. Um, first, I'm going to kind of loosen up with the speed stick, make sure that kind of my thoracic spine and my, uh, um, ugh, what's the top one? Cervical spine are kind of moving properly. Um, we're going to hit a couple three irons. We're going to hit eight three irons. We're going to hit eight three woods. And we're going to hit eight drivers, checking the club head speed and the ball speed, trying to hit certain goals. Then we're going to go ahead and we're going to play Wilshire Country Club. It should be pretty fun. Yesterday I played okay. I shot two under. This season is going to be 20 different rounds on difficult golf courses. This one's a four out of five, so it's quite a difficult golf course. But let's get into it, man. Uh, obviously, as always, this is a live stream, so please feel free to ask questions, say hi. Um, if you like the videos, I do this quite often, so please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Um, this is the stead head. I like to throw it on to make sure that I get good separation. So the head stays still, and then I get a nice good full rotation. We're just making sure that my body's rotating. I'm going to do five swings like this. Uh, three. Four. So we're really going for speed. I'm warmed up, but I haven't hit these three irons. I haven't hit these three woods. I haven't hit these drivers. So this is going to be good for me. This is the fifth one. Keep the head still and then accelerate. All right, guys. So we're going to start with our three irons. PGA Tour average. PGA Tour average is uh, 139. So I would like to get up into kind of the 148 territory. We'll see if we can go ahead and uh, do that. You know what, I'm actually going to leave the stead head on for the first couple swings. Um, it may not be... We'll see what kind of speed we can get with it on, then I'm going to take it off and just want to make sure my body's separating properly. So it felt good. Just below PGA Tour average. We're going to get this into the mid 140s. Like I said, that's the first long iron of the day. All right, 216 is not that bad though. Oh, I miss it. What's that club head speed? 96. Yeah, so we're going to be getting it up to like 100, 105. Right now, this is actually almost part of the warm up. But it's going to be good for me. All right, come on. All right, we're going to start swinging hard here. So we're going for 148 ball speed, which is actually 9 miles per hour faster than PGA Tour average. 144, very solid, quite fast. We're getting there. So that's, you know, obviously because I swung hard that time, that one went 240 yards. So my goal kind of towards the end of the season. All right, Jake, you know, I'm going to try, man. I'm going to try my best. All right, I'm feeling good. The head's staying still. Let's get some speed going. Forty-one. Yeah, I'm doing the full the, the, the full um, speed training today where I'm going to do the three irons, I'm going to do the three woods, I'm going to do the drivers. I really just want to actually keep working on it and be ready for this round. Forty-two. So guys, it's all above PGA Tour average. I would like to be hitting it just a little bit harder. So we're gonna we're, we're gonna give it some here. Okay. Come on. Not bad, 142. How many more swings do we got? So 148 is the goal, guys, and I'm gonna start cranking it because 
just time to stop messing around. What a shame. All right, I got two more, guys. All right, so we're really going to try to get one. You know, a 240-yard uh, three iron is pretty good for me, but we're really going to try to crank up that speed. Oh, that had more speed, but I mishit it. Yep. All right, guys. So it's not going to go short. You know, 230 is pretty good. All right. Last one, guys. 148 is the goal. Let's see if we can get it up there. If not, we're going to have a chance with three wood and then the main event with driver. And then we go play. Let's do it. Ah, 143. That's a little blocky too. That wasn't my best swing. All right, guys. Not so bad. I feel like it's pretty good. I'm starting to kind of get some, uh, get warmed up for the day. We're gonna go ahead. We're gonna, you know, ball speed mid 140s. It's not bad. It's definitely well above PGA Tour average. Let's see if we can really crank it here now. Um, all right, we're going to do three wood. PGA Tour average is 157. We are going for 165, guys. 165 is what we're going for. It's eight shots we get. Eight shots, and then we're moving up to driver. Should be fun. All right, let's do it. Fifty-seven, exactly PGA Tour average. Uh, for me, that was a bit of a miss hit. I have more speed than that. Hey, Jack, what's going on, man? Fifty-nine. Oh no, Jack! I finally sorted out my swing. I went out and played uh, last Friday at the course, and dude, it was windy, and I, I hit sixteen greens. Oh God, you're in school. All right. So I finally kind of, I, I went through a swing change and I had that driver that I wasn't hitting that well. So I'm so psyched. I'm finally hitting the ball better. The swing feels good. All right, guys, that's a buck 60. That's above PGA to our average. Yeah, it was windy. I shot like three or four under, um, which, you know, considering I haven't been playing outside, was not bad. You're in school right now. Oh, no. Um, all right, so guys, we are really going to try to get this club head speed into kind of 111 zone. We're going to try to get this ball speed in the mid 160s. There it is. So we got 108. Point, I guess 109, really. That's 165 ball speed. And there's going to be your kind of like 300-ish yard three wood right there. So not bad. All right, guys. So here we go. I'm really going for more 165. That was a little small low. Doesn't miss it. Not a bad swing by any means, just a little bit of a miss hit. <clears throat> yeah, so Wilshire Country Club should be fun. I've played it pretty well before. It's a four out of five difficulty, so it's a harder golf course. Miss hit. God. So the swing feels super good. I mean, all of these are just kind of right down the center, no problems. So I'm hitting the ball very, very well. But uh, and I kind of hit my goal with the 165. But let's let's try to hit it again. I think the fastest I've ever gotten with my three wood is like 169. So let's see if we can get kind of 166.
It's 61. I mean, it's above PGA Tour average. It's just not what... I just want better than that. I want better than that, guys. I'm just not hitting it that solid, to be honest. All right. So let's see here. We're going to do this. I got two more, guys. 165. We're getting it. 165 ball speed. It's 8 miles per hour above. There you go. So that's about 110 club head speed for a three woods. Not bad. That one's going to be over 300. So solid, guys. 165. Not bad. I'm happy with that. Let's see if we can do it one more time, and then we're going to move into the main event. We got the driver, or we're going to try to get it really up into the mid 170s. Ah, another miss hit. Guys, very, very good ball striking. I think I hit all of them in the grid. All of them were around 280 to 300. So I think, you know, definitely striking the ball well. I've been playing well lately. But did not quite get my speed. Yeah, so all of them were in the grid. All of them were good shots. Uh, 306 was the top dog. So we're going to go for this last one here. Driver. The goal is going to be 175. I actually haven't hit 175 in a while. I've been hitting a lot of 174. So we're going to try for 175, guys. <clears throat> Whew. All right, let's do this, guys. Seven point six. So that's PGA Tour average. That ball is high. It's not very long. Yeah. No, that's not my best. We can do better, guys. PGA Tour average is not good enough. I want to be better than average. Better than the average. I mean, on the PGA Tour, I guess it's not that bad. But let's uh, let's do better. One seventy-five, guys. All right, 169, guys. You know, club head speed's right, 113. You know, 310 yards. Not that bad. Not that bad. So let me get this other one here. I really, really want to at least get to like 175. Alright, let's do it guys. One seventy. Just dead straight. Three ten. All right, guys. I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. Like that was. It's not that it was a bad swing. I just didn't. I'm not clocking it. Like I'm not hitting it really solid. And that's what I need to get that ball speed up. Fifteen, just a little pull, guys. I need to hit the gym. You know, I haven't been that great about the gym. It's probably that's probably what's causing it a little bit. I need to get serious, eat some food, do better this way because I should be getting there higher.
173, there you go. All right, so that's more like it. 173 ball speed. <laughs> you know, that one went 320, the other ones are going 310. You know, I'm very happy with the consistency. The consistency is good. Um, we just gotta, I just wanna, I, I would rather see the ball speed be in the 150s, or, or 175s a little bit more often. I know. I hit the seven iron like John Daly hit the three. So John, when I was really getting ready for the season this last time, um, I was getting it up to like 120. So like right now it's like a little bit low for me, but I'm gonna get it back. Oh, so I don't love that. That's a little out of control. No, no. Guys, 115. We're going to do better than this. All right, I got two more, guys. The goal is 175. We are going to crank these bad boys. Here we go. All right, 175, we're gonna do it. <laughs> 171. All right, all that pump up for an average shot. I mean, don't get me wrong, like 320 down the center is like good, I'm happy with it, but but we're going to do better over this season. So a season's going to be 20, 20 rounds. A lot of the times I'm going to be doing it four to five days a week at 12 o'clock. And, uh, and I'm going to get it up to, I'm going to try to get this ball club head speed up to 120. again. All right, guys, not bad. It looks like my club head speed's right around 115 today. Uh, it looks like the ball speed's right around like 172, 173. You know, that wasn't bad. Almost 330. All right, guys, without further ado, let's get to it. Let's see what it looks like. All right, pretty good. Uh, 330 is the longest. Let's go play Wilshire Country Club. Let's see if we can play good today. Should be fun. All right, courses. We got it up here, Wilshire. Make sure I'm thanking the text. 6,500 yards. It's a hard golf course, but it's not that. Um, but it's not that long. So if I remember, because I have played this before, it's quite slopey. So there's a lot of times where you're hitting in like a decent shot, and it comes in just right of a pin and then it kind of bounces and bobbles away. So that's kind of the type of golf course that we're dealing with here. Um, and it's often very tight. You've got water, you've got OB. So the idea of, of just mindlessly hitting driver, you can't really do that. Um, so we'll see how this goes today. Um, it should be pretty fun. Hopefully I can play well. I'm trying to figure out what my goal is for an entire season of play. So I got 20 rounds. 20 rounds. Do you guys think in 20 rounds it's reasonable to try to shoot 40 under? 40 under is kind of a hope maybe. 40 under for 20 rounds. All right, so we got OB right. You got stuff left. Yeah. So guys, I'm just in the three wood down here. This is a very, very tight golf hole. Let's just try to hit a three wood down the center of the fairway. That was a bad swing. Real bad swing. Sit. Guys, I hit every single three wood perfect. Then I get up on the first hole and I hit like a shitty, shitty golf shot. Um, Alright, 128. Great, this is horrible. Now I gotta hit like a low shot because I can't 
I don't want to hit it into this stuff. Let's see how bad it is. 83. Wow, that's really bad. Um, all right, so 25. So I got to hit this probably around 150 yards. And it's got to be a knockdown because I need to keep it under this tree. So 150 yards. I'm basically going to hit a 9 o'clock 7 iron, guys. All right, guys, I'm super happy. I was able to keep that under under the tree, get it on the green, 33 feet. It's not ideal. I would have liked a birdie opportunity here, but I'm, I'm happy that at least I was able to get a nice green regulation. All right, so I just got to get the grid on. Okay, here we go, guys. We got the grid on. All right, we've got 20 feet. Go, 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 go. It trickled on down there. It's not perfect, but at least I got it down in the ballpark. All right. Here we go. All right, we got a par five, guys. Not bad. Let me, uh, let me see if I can make sure that, you know, because I landed right around the 290 zone. There you go. All right, let's see if we can get a good shot, get in a good position. So guys, it's not like I smoked that. I'm not swinging like out of my shoes. Just a nice 300 yard shot right down the center of the fairway. So that's a good position to be in. Not even 290 yards, but I got 231. All right. All right guys, so here we go. I actually lived in LA for six years. I don't think I ever played this golf course. All right, so I got 231. It's about seven miles per hour into the wind. So I guess the question is, do I think I can get my three iron there or not? All right, I'm gonna try. So it's a touch of a block, nothing crazy. On the green, front right, 53 feet, but a good opportunity to make a birdie here. Okay, so it's definitely left to right at first. So I'm gonna just aim it kind of left, 52 footer, let's see what I got. Go, 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 go. Shoot, did I leave it short? Oh, God, the putting is tricky, guys. Oh, man, all I had to do is get it up there. Sometimes when you hit it hard, it just shoots off, though, so it's hard to know. All right, let's just see. Honestly, 14 feet, essentially straight, so let's just see what I can do. It's like right in the hole. Come on, okay, so like that's a good example. Let me just complain a little bit, right? You got one, two, three, four, all, this is about 13 feet to that hole. So my ball hit that hole with some speed. So it at least had three or four feet left. So that ball should have traveled 16, 17 feet and it's saying it only traveled eight. This is why I have that gimme zone. Um, all right, here we go guys. So this is kind of one of those tough holes. It's almost drivable, not quite, but almost drivable. But it's very, very tight. So I'm gonna just try to hit something up to the left of the green and hope that I can kind of have a nice little pitch shot that will, uh, that will put me 
in a birdie position, at the very least. All right, hard driver, guys. Oh, I had no idea that was water. Stay out of the water. Oh my god. I should have done the fly through because I thought that that was just grass and I thought I was going to uh, carry it all. Alright, so I got 68. I, I, I think I got away with one here. Let's see what it is. 80%, so we got 70, so plus 20% is plus 14. So we're dealing with essentially 85 yards. Okay, I can do 85 yards. So I got 85 yards, guys. And all that I want to do, let me gather all these golf balls. Hello, camera. So I don't have to deal with the golf ball thing. All right, guys. So for me, a nine o'clock 58 is a good, is a good 85 yard shot. Come on, get close. All right, guys, somehow I clawed a birdie out of that. Kind of makes up for, for the last ball. I don't want to break my step head. <laughs> Just on the ground. All right, we got a buck 26, crosswind. I'm going to aim it a touch right. Okay. So, guys, for me, this is just like a nice knockdown pitching wedge. So, let's do it. 10 o'clock pitching wedge. Yep. Should be just about right, shouldn't it? The the number. Sit, 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 sit. Oh. Right over the stick, guys. Not bad, right over the stick. We got 19 feet. Got right to left. Okay, let's do it. And let me get this out of the way. So it is directly in my way, and I'm pretty sure the ball is just trapped. All right, here we go. Oh, that's about perfect. Get in. Sit, sit, sit. All right, I'm pretty happy with that putt. Just missed on the high side. Pretty solid. Oh, thanks, Jaken. All right, so here we go, guys. So guys, this is a three wood. I'm gonna run out of room. It's about 285. So I can hit just a smooth three wood, like I don't, I can't hit this too hard, but I can hit a nice smooth three wood and this will be fine. Stay away from that bunker. Huh. Guys, this is a very tight golf course. Um, that, that three wood was maybe 10 yards. At least I'm not in the, in the bunker. Um, but I think I have a side hill lie, so 85, so that's 15%. So we're dealing with probably at least 130 yard shot. 130 yard shot, I definitely have a side hill lie, so I'm gonna have to aim this a little to the right. All right, let's do it. Oh my God, I was wrong about my side hill eye. So that's where I was aimed. I thought it would jump off left, which happens a lot when I am on a side slope.
but I guess I wasn't on a side slope. All right, I tried. All right, so we got 14 yards, that's 28. All right, that's 42, yeah. Sit, sit, sit. All right, I'll take that. I will take that. All right, guys. Let's make some birdies. I'm kind of tired of these pars. Hitting decent shots, getting in a lot of trouble. All right. Oh, guys, once again, I'm forced. No, I can't do that. All right, guys, once again, I'm forced into a three wood or I have to draw a driver, right? So I actually hit a successful draw yesterday. But if I don't draw it, then, then, I make du then I'm gonna make double, it's gonna go OB. So I'm gonna just hit a three wood, just in the name of safety. Still aggressive, let's do this. This golf course is tight. Stop, stop. All right, guys, I'm not OB, but I am in trouble. All right, I'm gonna have to be more respectful to this golf course, because if not, it's gonna beat the crap out of me. Um, fuck. All right, no fun, guys. Oh my goodness. So I'm going to just aim out to the left, guys. Yeah, and we're just going to punch it out. Take where it's like a 7-iron, yep. It's going to be just a nice little knockdown 7-iron here. Just advance it. Try to make par the very hard way. All right, here we go, guys. I got a 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock nine iron. I'll be a little aggressive with it. Let's do it. Go, go, go. Oh, it was a good golf shot, guys. 14 feet. Not quite inside the gimme zone. I'm going to have to go ahead and make that. You know, putts can be made on this. It is possible. 18 feet. Let's do it. Get in. Oh, my God. Oh, it was so close, guys. Oh, that's just painful. All right, that's a bogey. Serves me right, honestly. I, I, I need to be more conservative. This is a very tight golf course. Um, all right, so here we go, guys. You got a tight lip, and there's a little bit of wind today. There's like seven, eight miles per hour. So I'm going to aim this a touch right. It's going to be a little knockdown, nine o'clock, nine iron. to touch too far. Damn it. 34 feet. All right, so I gotta put this to butter. We got 34 feet, definitely downhill. Definitely downhill, so it's playing more like 22 feet. Nice. 
That felt just about right. All right, guys, I got my par. Let me get the hell out of here. It's just the course is slopey and it's tight. All right, here we go. Relatively straight. Yeah, relatively straight. It's just, let's just drive her down the center, honestly. It's tight as hell. Let me see what I'm dealing with. I mean, I won't. All right, gotta hit it good. Guys, I am getting clobbered by this golf course. I think I'm just being too aggressive. Like, that was left, but it's just not crazy left, if you're being honest. Like, the club path was 0.5. And I'm just totally fucked. Alright guys, I gotta punch out to the left again. Nothing I can do about it. I wish I didn't have to. I'm gonna punch out to the left, try to knock it close. I get, honestly, I gotta back off a little bit. I, I said that I had to, and I didn't back off. Um, and I really need to. So I chipped out. Hopefully, I can stick a wedge here. But I just this course is extremely tight, and I need to back off it. All right, so I'm way downhill. You got 75 feet yards. All right, so this is going to be just a nice, aggressive 8 o'clock 58. Yeah, 8 o'clock. I'm going to just aim this a touch right because I got some serious wind coming right to the left. Okay. Spin, spin, spin. Guys, they still hit it long. Fuck. 23 feet, not the worst shot ever, but obviously I was really hoping to get it closer. All right, very downhill. You've got essentially an 11 foot putt. Oh my God. That would have been so much fun. All right, guys, I think that's back-to-back -back bogeys. Let's start playing some golf here. Oh, I'm grinding. Four hundred and nineteen yards. All right, this is open enough, so I can hit a driver. This is not. This is actually a driver that really is a driver. <laughs> Thanks, Jack. Pretty good. You know what? I'm pulling it. Shit. Stay right of it. Stay right of it. Get past it. All right, we're okay. Oh, maybe not. All right, hopefully I have a shot at the green. I'm pulling my driver, which is no fun. I was pulling my three iron yesterday. All right, I, I, I actually have a shot at the green, so that's good. I'm one over. God, I would love to make a birdie here. All right, guys, so I'm going to take my nine iron, and this is essentially playing 140, so let's do it. Not bad. Green and reg. Green and regulation. 23 feet. Would love to make a birdie here. Hard putt to make though. Let's see. So essentially a 15 footer. Oh. 
All right, guys. Shot one over on the front. Not my favorite. Not my best round. But uh, but I got the back nine to try to get some vengeance in. So we'll see how we do. All right, we got 125. What I really got to do is I got to start sticking these shots. So we got 125 yards. And let's let's stick this, Reed. Let's make a birdie. The ball is going so far. All right, guys. Obviously, I'm a little bit off, it seems. All right, I got 10 yards. Let's do this. 30, 30 feet, essentially. It's too long. Sit, sit, sit. Just got to barely, barely got away with it. All right, guys. So here we go. Got away with another par. I am grinding today, guys. Okay. This is okay. This is doable. All right. Driver right down the center. We're going to have a little wet shot in. We're making birdie. We're making birdie on this one right now. Very solid. All right, we got a good drive down the fairway. That's step one. That's step one in making a birdie. Step two in making a birdie is a good wedge shot, so coming right up. We got 75 yards. Wow. I do not have much confidence in my swing. My speed is so down because I just have not been hitting it straight enough. All right. All right, here we go, guys. I got uh, 73. All right, let's do this. Nice, easy 9 o'clock. Why the fuck are my irons going so far? Spin. Man, I am hitting everything too far with my irons. All right, guys. We got left to right, 10 feet. Let's see if I can make it. Come on, come on, birdie baby. Give me a par five, give me a par five right now. Nope. All right, I'll take it though. Okay, so we got water left, OB right guys. So I right away, I do not think this is a driver hole. Well, maybe. I take it back, this is a driver hole. All right, so I'm going to hit a driver. This is going to go straight down the center, and we're going to be all good. The ugly stick. I know it, man. All right. Here we go. Driver right down the pipe. That felt pretty good. All right, step one done. We got the part. We got the driver straight down the center, even though there's OB right and water left. All right, good drive too. All right, so here we go. I got what 80 yards in. Okay, come on, guys. I know I haven't been flagging these, but I know that it's in there somewhere. Come on. Nice, smooth nine o'clock here. Nice and smooth. Be the number. Be the number. Sit, 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 sit. Come on, please. Please. 
Yes. All right, come on, let's do it. All right, we're back to the red, guys. We're back to the red. Give me part five. Give me part. Oh, no. So badly want that part five. All right, so we got downwind, 173 yards, guys. This is a perfect little knockdown seven iron for me. All right. God, these greens are tight. I thought it was a good shot. It looked good. It was not bad. It was like right on its target too. All right, guys. So I gotta have to grind away here. We got 13 yards. That's like 39 feet. I gotta flip this up. Sit, 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 sit. All right. Come on. All right, give me a part five. Oh, I hope the next one's a part five. Let's give me a part five, I need it. Part five, baby, come on. All right, guys, so here's our opportunity. We got OV right, we got water left. So it's, it's looking like it is a doable, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm dealing with here. Do a fly by, tee the green. All right, so, so yes, there's water all down the left, and that right shit is OB. So it loosens up a little bit after that bunker. I don't know how far that bunker is, but it loosens up a little after that bunker. So hopefully we can do good. God, look at how tight that green is. I'm going to go play this golf course for real. Um, all right, so I got my driver up. No, yeah, so I cannot get to that bunker, so I'm going to have to hit it down the tight, tight rope. All right, let's do it, guys. Driver down the pipe. Oh, I hit it good. So I got it right to the top of that hill. Stop whatever you're doing. Whatever that is, stop. All right. Um, so it was straight into the wind. It only went 285 yards, but I mean, it was straight into the wind. So that was a good shot. So I've got 216 yards straight into the wind, but not, not crazy, like five, six, seven miles per hour. All right, guys, so this is just a smooth three iron for me, honestly. So this is a super tight green, but if I can hit it, it would be fantastic. So I'm on a side slope. So I'm gonna aim this a little bit right because I know it's gonna jump left. All right, guys, wish me luck. Let's do this. Try to flag this thing. Sit, sit. So guys, I ripped it through the wind. I'm shocked. It's freaking, this is a three iron. I was 216 out uphill into the wind. That thing went 240. All right, not a bad shot. Not a bad shot. Good birdie opportunity here. If I can just go ahead, find a way to chip this thing close. All right, so you got 25 yards. It's 75 feet. Okay. Get in the hole. Please get in the hole. Please get in the hole. Oh my God. All right, guys. Birdie. We got it. All right. So we got, whoa. All right, guys, I'm going to do the flyby here too. Because it's like a, well, I don't need to do the flyby. But guys, this is a reachable part uh, four. Don't need to do the flyby because it doesn't look like there's much up there. But if I can just absolutely hit a perfect driver here, I might have a putt for Eagle. So let's let's give it a try. Go. 
Go, go, go. All right, guys, it got up in the air. I have about seven or eight miles per hour of traffic into me. So 65 feet, I'm happy with that, honestly. Good, solid. All right, guys, so this is even closer than the last one. So let's see if I can hit another good shift. Because that last one was pretty solid. All right, let's do this. All right, 21 feet, that's 63 feet, or 21 yards, 63 feet. Let's knock this close. Go, go, go. I knew it. As soon as I hit it, I knew I hit that short. God! 15 feet. All right, guys. A little left to right, 19 feet. Let's see if we can make it. Come on. Yes. All right. We got another part five. All right, let's do it, guys. This one's about 540. Solid part five here. Pretty tight. I'm going to show you what we're dealing with here. Well, you know what? It's pretty self-explanatory. Just drive her down the center. Let's see if we can do it. So it looks like I'm going to have in the ballpark of th uh, just, what, like 240 in? All right. No, 250 in. Okay. So I'm just going to check out what's up by that green because it looks like there's some water around there. So fly to green. There's water everywhere other than back right. So guys, I don't actually love this shot. I'm not doing it. So, um, you guys can make fun of me all you want. I'm hitting a six iron down the fairway. From 250, I'm having to hit a knockdown three wood. It's not gonna happen, I'm not doing it. So guys, the whole goal of this shot is just to give myself a really easy, good opportunity to stick the shot. Because I could have reached that green, right? But if I wasn't going at it with like a three iron, it's just tight, there's not much room. All right, so we got 75 yards now, a little bit downhill, crosswind. So I'm... We're gonna really here we go, right now. Let's do it guys. Spin, spin hard. God, I have been off with my wedges, guys. It's not been horrible, but it has not been great. All right, guys, let's see if I can make this. I would love to make a nice little birdie here. All right, a little right to left, 13 feet. Let's do it. All right, two putt, guys. We're doing okay. All right, we got 350 yards, 17th hole. 
We got water right, trees left. I'm, I'm just hitting a three iron, guys. I've gotten bit by this course so many times. I have a decent round going. I just, there's no reason to push something. Let's try to make a birdie the hard way, honestly. So this is just gonna be a three iron down the center of the fairway. Guys, I'm kind of thinking that's going to leave me like 140 yards in, which for me just seems like the right move. 160 yards in, wow. That's that's a little more than I wanted, I'm not going to lie, but still okay. Still got a decent shot in the pin. Can even make birdie with this, so let's let's give this a try. shot just a little out to the right. Alright guys, green and red. No harm. Okay, right to left for sure. We got 32 feet. So this is basically 26 feet. Dive, dive, dive. All right, good par there. All right, here we go. All right, I've got 400 yards. Wow, this is a weird. All right, guys, I've got to hit a three wood down the left side here. It's a weird hole, but let's just play it the way that it's supposed to be played. Try to make a nice par here. Yeah, because we don't need to be messing, messing with stuff. Good, good solid swing, just down the fairway. All right, I got 162 into the green. So we got kind of another one of these like mid shots. I'm gonna hit another seven iron, and this one we're just gonna try to stick. Pretty good golf shot. Oh, so guys, obviously that is a ridiculously tight green. Guys, I'm only 18 feet from the pin. I don't even think I'm on the green. I'm not. So I would love to chip this in or essentially make this putt. So it's a 19 footer. Here we go, guys. 19 footer. Let's see if we can do it. Love to make this. Let's do it. Easy. Get in. Get in. All right, guys. Almost. All right. So what ended up shooting? There wasn't a lot of par fives. I think there was only three par fives. God, that tight. Uh, that course is tight. Um, honestly, I wish my wedges were a little bit more on. My wedges are a little off. You know, I shot four under on the back. I'm happy with that. You know, that was a 68 three under. Not my best golf ever, but all in all, it kind of held together and, and got a pretty good round together. So, um, all right, well, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you are, if you haven't subscribed to the channel and you like this video, please go ahead and subscribe. Other than that, 
Jack, Jason, um, Jeff, man, it's awesome seeing everyone. Jake, good talking to you, man. Talk to you guys later.